Hello. Hi, hi, hi. Hello. How is everybody? Happy Sunday evening. I am Robin, and this is Raincross Farms Makery. Behind the computer and behind the camera is my husband, Bill. And we are located just outside of Lewiston, Idaho. And we like to craft and we like to show you some new ideas and inspire you to be creative on your own. So welcome. When you get here, say hello so we can say hello back. And I am going to look for the live on my phone and get it up. And turn down the volume. So, hey, Pete. Hey, Tina. Hey, Cheryl. Welcome. How is everybody? Did you have a good weekend and are you ready for the new week? Always ready. <laughs> Always ready. Always ready. Ever ready. Oh, what you doing, Duke? Okay, real quick. Real quick. No. Okay, never mind. He was going to come up for a minute, but he changed his mind. Well, he's a chihuahua. What he's a saying? chihuahua. What do you know? He's not a chihuahua. Awesome. Okay. I'm upset with myself. I fell asleep yesterday and missed this. Oh, no. Well, I had to tag you, but I knew you had said you weren't sure you were going to be able to make it. But you probably needed, you probably needed to sleep more, right? Okay, so... If you watch Facebook Lives, you know what to do. Love our page. Give us some hearts. Give us some thumbs up. Follow us if you're not already following. And if you would be so kind as to share our video out to your page, to your friends, or to a crafting group that you belong to, we would certainly appreciate it. So, yes, we did. Cheryl is talking about our Zoom meeting. Last night we had a special Zoom crafting party for my uh, club members and my design team. And we had, we had, how many did we have? Seven, seven there, six there, like six or seven people there. So it was a lot of fun. I wanna do them every month. So if you'd like to get in on those, you just need to be one of my club, club members or one of my designers. So anyway, so 10 hours straight. Then you, you needed it, girl, you needed it. Sometimes you do. Okay, let's see. Tonight's project. Before I get started with the project, I've got to say, I am so close to my sales goal. So I'm extending the flash sale until the last possible moment. So if you would like to get a discount on anything, anything that's currently in stock in the catalog, there is a link in the pinned comments where it says, get in on my end of the month flash, tail, flash sale, click there for more info. And that takes you to a post in my VIP group that gives you all the information and discounts available. So if you click on that and you're not a member of my VIP group, not a big deal, just ask to join. It's absolutely free, no obligation. And we'll get you in and you can start shopping at a discount. I can't tell you the discount right now, on my business page, but it's a good deal. Anyway, I'm desperately trying to get, what is it? $230 more in sales before tomorrow night. So like within 24 hours, I can do it, right? I can do it. Okay, so the project we're gonna work on tonight is we're gonna use this transfer. This is called House Cutout Trio Patterns. So we have a set of wooden cutouts in the shape of houses and this transfer is designed to decorate them front and back. So we're going to start with one of them tonight because Bill says my lives go too long. Uh -huh. So we're going to do one at a time. Uh -huh. Okay. So let me show you this kit. It comes with three different houses, three different sizes. I'll tell you about those in a minute. So this is awesome. This is really good quality. This is wood. It is maybe three quarters to seven eighths of an inch wide. So it's wide enough that it can stand on its own. So you can put it on a shelf. You can put it in a tiered tray. But it comes with these three house cutouts. The Papa, the Papa house, the Mama house, and the Baby house. So those are just adorable. One of them has the little chimney. This one's really cool. It's got a beveled 
a beveled edge front and back to the roof. So that gives it a little bit of dimension. And then you also get these little, what are these called? Slim cuts, they call them. They are just thinner wood. And those are the, the doors and the windows. And you can decorate them with parts of the transfer. So super cool, don't you think? My lives are not too long. Bill is just being a spoil sport. Wow. I, I didn't say that. And I didn't pay her to say that. Whatever. That is an unsolicited opinion there. Whatever. <laughs> okay, so we're going we're gonna to do the big guy tonight. And I'm going to set those aside. Oh, and you also get these little double-sided adhesive tabs to attach this. So you don't have to use um, hot glue, but you can if you want. So double-sided, they're painted a really pretty white, but you can paint them a different color if you want. You can stain it. You can antique it. You can sand it off and bring it down to wood. Whatever, whatever your design decor style is. So we are going to, we're going to paint one side and we're going to antique the other side. But I'm going to get this out. So all the different pieces here. So here's, here's some words that can fit on the, the tall house. It says, leave your worries at the door. And I'm planning on putting this, we have a little long table near our front door so i'm planning on putting having a little um collection of these houses and i think that'd be very appropriate leave your worries at the door hey alana i'm glad you had fun last night i did too i i wished more people could have been there but it was very nice the size it was we got to the best part is we got to see each other's faces and not just see each other's typing so you get to know each other a little bit with your comments, but you really seem to get to know each other, get a little better feeling for each other when you can actually see faces. So that was exciting. So again, I hope I, hope I have more people joining us next time. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna leave this all on the, on the backer paper. So I am just going to <laughs> you know you won't you'll get over it you'll be fine cheryl we didn't talk about you honest we didn't okay so i'm going to take my exacto knife <laughs> bill is sitting on the floor with the dogs <laughs> so i can't even see him <laughs> like, where did he go he's down on the floor so i'm going to take my exacto knife and i'm just going to lightly score through these little threads right here you can kind of see that line but I'm not going to cut through the backer. I'm going to try to not cut through the backer. I could cut the whole thing apart, but then I'm forever chasing. Whoops, kind of went off my line. Then I am forever chasing little pieces of backer and little pieces of transfer. So I'm, I kind of like to leave them on the backer. So they kind of have a home to come to. Do we have anybody new here tonight? I see some numbers, but I'm not seeing all those people commenting. So if you're here and you don't mind, say hello. Promise we won't, we don't bite hard. Not hard. And we generally try not to pick on anybody uh, speak for yourself okay well we would like to say hello especially if you're new you're old you are not old old is just a number right it might be a really big number but age is just a number okay so let me hopefully i've got that Okay, now there is there is a difference on to which side this goes because this has, I don't know if you can see it, this has a little flower that goes up higher. So this is meant to go on that chimney part. So 
that's going to go on this side. So this is going to be the side that we are actually going to antique. So we are going to paint this side. And the colors that I like to use in my house, you, you might do something different, but I like to use a, a green and a black and, and white. Those are kind of, and wood tones. Those are kind of the colors that I inherited, but I like. <laughs> I didn't do a whole lot of changing when we moved in here. So I'm going to use eucalyptus, and I'm actually going to paint this kind of a not solid paint, but kind of put a little watercolor over it with the actual chalk paste. So this is Chalkology paste. I need the old stencil Baby Milestones. I don't have it, Tammy. I'll look I'll look it up. I've got a couple of websites that of, of designers that I can go to and see. So let me see if I can find it for you. So I'm going to take our paste. You can also use it as paint. It's as a paste, it's pretty thick. So you don't want to use that. You don't want to use the paste consistency to paint with. So I've got a little bit of the paste I put it I just put it in my lid and I'm going to water it down and I'm going to use my brush now I I sprayed in here distilled water oh hi Tammy by the way I didn't I just answered your question I didn't say hello I used distilled water because that way if I don't use all of this I can put it back in my jar and because I use distilled water I'm not going to have anything growing, no mold or bacteria or anything. So let me see if that is thin enough. Pretty close. It's kind of thinning out. So I'm not, I'm going to try to not go over the edges. Daisy is doing really well. She's sitting here by me. In fact, we have to sit on her on a regular basis now. Oh, my goodness. Now. She wants to go out and run. But she's still not supposed to be doing that. No, she's... It was supposed to be another month before and she... Her brother is no help. Okay, so I'm giving that just a light coat, and it's... It's a little streaky and that's okay. I could I could solve that by putting another coat on, but I kind of like I kind of like seeing a little bit of the streakiness cuz I'm try I'm not really trying to make this a solid solid color. I am trying to make those lines a little bit straighter. Looks good. Okay, so I, I used most of this, but not all of it. So I'm just going to put the rest of this back in my container. And again, because I didn't, because I used distilled water, I'm not worried about any little creepy stuff growing in there. I'm gonna put the lid on that for just now, for right now, and I'm gonna get my drying tool. I'm sorry. But not your heat gun. Not my heat gun. I have it on good authority to not dry your transfers with a heat gun. <laughs> it will not end well. <laughs> I'm trying to get a photo of it. Hey, Tammy, I have a question. The, the baby milestones, is that the one where you can, um, you lay down the baby every month and take pictures? Is that the one? Or is it the, they used to have one that was like a growth chart. I'll look it up by that title, but I just kind of have an idea of what I'm looking for. Yeah, 
and it's mostly dry. I'm going to said yes. Yes. Yes, the first thing I said, the the month by month photograph thing. I'm going to take just a slightly damp the month. The month. Okay. I will look for that. I think that's a pretty old one. But it might somebody's somebody's got it out there. I just took a slightly wet brush to kind of smooth out a couple of little sections. And this dries pretty quickly. Of that color. So this was again, this was eucalyptus. If you like, if you like this transfer set and the and the wood block cutout, you can type in the word houses in the in the comment and I'll send you a link. Hey Netta, I'll send you a link to the to the supplies and you can take a look at pricing. And I think I threw in a couple of paste packets. I'm pretty sure I put in a eucalyptus color, but if you don't like that. You can remove that from the cart and you can go into the shop, go back to look at products and you can find a color that is, is better for you. Okay, so I've got this painted, this side painted green and I'm going to do a little distressing on the edges. I like our surfaces because you can sand down that paint and you get a little bit of, of wood showing through. So it looks a little aged. A little tricky getting in those peaks of the roof. Hey Netta, I saw your name. You need to say hello. No lurking. Nothing gets behind beside you, does it? <laughs> well, it shows up on me. If I guess if you're friends of mine, it will tell me when you're watching. Even though you might not have commented. I don't know why it is. People don't want to comment. Don't want. I don't know. I guess I I used to do the same thing. I would do lurk. I would lurk. So I've kind of got, it kind of gives it a little border, a little edge, a little wood showing, peeking through, and a little more wood peeking through. And I'm going to do the back side too, even though I'm not going to paint that. The sanding block I got from the Dollar Tree, but they also have them in hardware stores, Home Depot, Lowe's, Ace. I don't know if you can get them for a dollar. They might be a little better quality, but for crafting, these are these work just fine, in my opinion. So if I wanted to use enough elbow grease, I could completely take off the paint. Or I could go out into the garage and I could borrow the power sander. Wait a minute, who said? You'll be gone sometime. <laughs> you can't watch me 24-7. <laughs> you are not a lurker. I'm not a what? Cheryl said she's a lurker. She is not. Maybe she's you know, a looker. A looker, maybe. Yeah, there you go. Maybe. I don't know. You weren't at the you weren't at the Zoom, so I don't know if you're a looker or not. Okay. Those that weren't on the live didn't get to see him get to see me make fun of my wife. Not oh yes, he had me. lots of fun. We are not we are Zoom newbies. We are Zoom newbies, so uh, he was he was playing around with filters and all kinds of stuff and changed my name. 
So uh, now I'm just kind of working on these corners. Okay. I will sand, I will clean that up better, but okay, so there we go. Oh, and you're not above. I don't know if you can kind of see. I kind of have a little strip of wood showing through front and back. Let me get a paper towel. Let me get it a little bit damp and clean up all of this sawdust. And I'm going to quickly kind of clean up this. I should get a tack rag, but I don't have one. Okay. So I've got that cleaned up. <laughs> Dirty hands. I'm going to wash them. All you have to do is ask for a tap. Is there no, did we record cards. did we record the zoom? We didn't record the zoom, did we? Did we record the zoom? We did not. We did not. We did not. Let me show you what we made. Well, what I made. Most people just watched and chatted, which is which is perfectly fine. But this is what this is what we made, what I made. So I used the, the club transfer, which looks like this, and I basically kind of flipped it all around. And so I made a little mountain out of a map, a page of maps, and Mod Podge glued that down. And then those little bicycles, those little wooden bicycles, I painted those up and glued them on. And it says, find joy in the journey up top. So that's what... That's the project I worked on. I think Don was working on something, but I think everybody else was just chilling and talking. Okay. So I just painted this and I'm going to protect it against the sticky transfers that I've got here. Because if I put this sticky down on here, it could very likely pull up the paint. And I don't want that. So first of all, I'm going to wax this. Um, ordinarily, I would use my surface wax, but our uh, the website is sold out of this for right now. But this is just paste wax. It's clear paste wax, odorless. I still think I still I still smell coconut in there. Anyway, but I'm going to use something different because you can't get that right now. I'm going to use dark wax. So this is dark paste wax. I believe I got this on Amazon, but you can get it in uh, craft stores. It's just paste wax, but it is dark. And I know people who refinish and restore furniture use this a lot when they use chalk paints. But what it does, and let me get, let me get a little microfiber cloth. What it does is it puts a little coat of color, antiquing color, on the surface. Um, but it still puts a wax coating on it. So let me show you. I'm going to show you on the white side. So I've got a little of this. And I just rub that wax on. And it kind of colors it a little bit. Not a lot. In fact, I'm going to buff a lot of this back off. So it just gives it a little, a little antique look. And I'm going to do the edges. Get in there, get in there. You don't need a lot of wax. In fact, you don't want to use a lot of wax or your paste won't stick. Okay, so I've got the back. And I'm going to go over this green too. Because I, I do need to wax. And this gives it just a, a slight variation of that color. I'm liking this. I love this. I love this dark wax. So again, Amazon. I think I have a link to it. I think I have a um, product link. So if you're, if you are in the Raincross Farms Makery Facebook page. 
up at the top there's some little tabs and if you find the one you might even have to go over where it says more if you find the one that says guides there will be a tab that says um, product links and in there i have i have some links to some products that i use have used i only recommend something that i have used myself before um, i believe there's a product link for this and disclaimer we are amazon associates so if you use our link to purchase anything we get a tiny 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 commission that does not cost you anything but we have to disclose that anytime we advertise our links okay so i i put the wax on and now i'm buffing it off most of it off both sides and so it feels smooth but it doesn't feel tacky or gummy or waxy okay, I'll put the lid on that and we are good to go and I'm going to stop for a second and take a drink okay so I put in a post today about soup how many of you have had soup lately it has been soup weather here it snowed again today which is just lovely a really light snow it won't stick it'll be melted by morning it might even be melted now i'm going to trim that little piece that i picked up okay so my second level you need to send me your amazon link I order a lot from them. Well, it's not it's not just a link. It's each product has a link. We generate a link for each product. And if you click on that link and purchase it, we get the credit for it. So if there's anything in particular, anything, um, let us know and we can generate a link for you. And that way we get we get a few pennies and you don't it doesn't cost you anything more. Okay, so my second layer of protection is I'm putting a little bit of fuzz on the back of this sticky transfer. So our transfers are reusable, adhesive, guaranteed that you can reuse this 10 to 12 times by the company as long as you treat it right and clean it up. Homemade chicken noodle soup the other day. Big pot of taco soup. I know you asked for the recipe today. Oh, you had your own recipe. So I think... I think I'm gonna try yours too. Hers, I'm telling Bill. Um, Cheryl, we exchanged taco soup recipes. Hers has uh, ranch ranch seasoning in it, so that might be that might be fun to try. Okay, so I'm trying to center this. I'm gonna hold it up, and that is completely crooked which is not acceptable okay so on this green i'm just going to chalk these words leave your worries at the door you ordered a new router how fun okay now i'm pushing this down so there's no air bubbles underneath and then i'm going to take my black this is black velvet chalk paste again with ranch style beans okay we just use the regular bean beans i guess the ranch style has seasonings in it okay so this is black velvet chalk paste i'm going to take my little thing and put some on here this is our small squeegee so i am just taking this squeegee and i'm dragging it across that screen so I'm pushing the paste in through that screen onto the surface. Now, a lot of you, and myself included, have used crickets and done something like this with a cricket where you've, you've made some words and you... Uh, a, a, lay them down on your surface this has no weeding no cutting no nothing 
watch this. This is peel and reveal. And I'm going to go kind of slow, so if there's any spots that I've missed, I can lay it right back down. Okay. Look at that. What do you think? Give me some hearts. Show me some hearts if you love it. I'm going to see a bunch of hearts flowing up there. Okay, so there we go. Leave your worries at the door. And you know what I discovered? Talking to Bill. You know what I discovered is I don't see hearts. I, you know, I have asked for hearts in the past. I don't see it on the monitor, but I see it on my phone. And I kept thinking, boy, nobody, nobody gives hearts. Nobody, nobody does it. Nobody responds when I say that. Well, because I can't see it on the on the monitor, but I can see it on my phone. So yes, I see lots of you like like this. Okay, so this is one side of my little house. I'm just hanging out with the dog down at the Well, good for you. Good for you. Okay, so I am, I'm drying this because I'm going to actually turn it over and I'm going to chalk on the other side. So I want to make sure this is really dry so I don't smudge it. Um, until I go to clean this transfer, I'm going to spray it with water so that paste stay, stays damp and doesn't dry. That will just make it easier when I go to clean it. Thank you, Linda. I, I love this whole set. I can't wait to get it all done. I would do it all at once, but Bill would say, you can't do an hour and a half live. Yeah. There are some people who do really long lives and they have people watching the whole time, but I understand you guys have might have other things to do. Okay, so that's dry. What do you think? Leave your worries at the door. Okay, now the other side I, I left white, I distressed the edges, and I used the antique wax. And on this side, I am going to put this little, I'm going to lay this down so I don't scratch until that's really dry. I'm going to use this little pattern. It's kind of, I don't know if those are flowers or they're just little designs. But we're going to use this on the back. So I've waxed this. Well, that's right. You did order this set. Yes, if anybody else is interested in ordering this set, it would help me get my $230 sales so I can meet my goal. It's my goal. It's not the company saying, you must sell this much. No, this is just my personal goal that I want to get to. Um, but $230 away, some of you have already put in two and three orders this month. I so appreciate that. In fact... I'm going to announce it tomorrow, but we now have all 14 spots on our spin to win wheel filled. Um, Linda, Linda Lou Lacey is number 14. So we will be spinning that wheel very soon. If you were with me when we unboxed the wheel and you saw that it was missing some parts. So we had to send that one back and reorder a new one. So I'm hoping the new one is here tomorrow and we can spin that yeah, wheel. Yes, a UPS delivery notification. So hopefully that's it. Okay, hopefully. We're having some real problems with the internet right at the moment. Not us, but uh, the Facebook end. thing. So sorry, it's getting sketchy <laughs> out there. Turn you loose with his debit card. Don't you write down the number? Write down the number, write down the, the little three-digit code, <laughs> write down the expiration date. Hey, Tracy's new. Hi, Tracy. Hey, Tracy. Yay, Tracy from, where is she? Oregon? No, where is she? Washington. Washington. Yakima. Yeah, oh, that's right, Yakima. Oh, that's right, because we are we way. may be going to Seattle. We might be stopping to see her. I want to meet Corky. Santa Claus. Santa, yes. Okay. I don't know if hey, I thank you, to, Julie. I used to play Santa Claus. Yes, you did. My wife made me a beautiful velvet red suit. And I'd go out to Boy Scouts and private parties and work at dealerships. 
car dealerships. It's okay. Thank you, Julie. Thank it's you so cool. much. Okay, so this side, I fuzzed and we waxed it, and I'm going to just, it's going to be kind of subtle, which, which is fine. I want it. On this antique white paint, I'm just going to use the eucalyptus so it will coordinate with the other side. And again, I'm just putting some on my squeegee, dragging it over that screen. Barbie says she's a first time watcher too. Awesome, thank you. South, South Carolina, you are, is that Eastern time or is that still mountain time? Central time, central time, central Eastern, I don't know. I'm just wondering how late it is for you. Okay, so I'm kind of, this transfer goes off the edge, so I'm just trying to make sure it all gets covered. And I'm going to... Welcome, Barbie and Trace. Thank you. I'm glad, I'm glad you are here. So I'm going to, I scraped off the excess, put it in my, back in my jar. I'm going to peel this up. I like it. What do you think? Pretty, it's so pretty good. cool. So okay, so I'm going to set that aside. I'll wash it in a moment. Spray it down so it doesn't dry. I'm done. Am I done? I don't know if I'm done with that. I might not be done with that. I'm going to dry this. And then I think we are going to put on a door and a window. Okay, we should just do a door or a door and a window. Door and a window. All these decisions. You have to help me decide. Okay. Okay, Barbie's at Eastern time, so you are three hours ahead of us. Three. I'll give you a couple visual. Oh, there you go. I can see those. I can see those. If you're ordering your chocolate tour stuff this week. Can't wait to get all the goodies. Awesome. Are you, are you aware of all this of the February specials? I don't want you to miss out on anything. I don't know if you're a club member. If not, well, let me just tell everybody because it's all it all goes away tomorrow. They're having an awesome special in February. If you are a club member, um, if you order $60 before tax and shipping, if you order $60, you get five free transfers which is just awesome, that's $75 value. And if you join the club this month, you get five free transfers with your first month. So that's awesome, that's 75%. Oh, you're a designer. Oh, are you getting your, is it your first order from the new catalog? Well, I'm gonna go ahead and tell everybody this anyway. So it's great for club members. If you join, you get five free transfers. If you're a current, club member and you order $60 worth of product, you get five free transfers, not the same five. Um, so that's awesome. That goes away. That goes away tomorrow at midnight mountain time. And of course I am having a flash sale. It will end. It will end on, let's see, 10 o'clock invoices have to be paid by 10 o'clock Pacific time tomorrow. Okay, so there's a link in the pinned comment if you're interested in the flash sale. Get yourself some discounts. Okay, so now I need I need some advice here. Oh, I'm good. I have advice. a door and a window. Where should they go? I'm, I'm waiting for them to respond because it's. Okay. Um, okay, so I always have my advice, but I always get told. Okay, no. so there's. I could put the door in the center, but I actually think it looks a little better off center. I don't know. Let me go over the top on that. Okay, so tell me what you think. Or I can leave it without. I can put, I can save the doors. 
for the other. Okay, so what do we think? We want a window way up high. Do we want no window and just a door? I need some ideas. Without anything? Yeah, I think that's a neat of a design. It lined up perfectly. Okay. I think well, you did a good job on that. What we can do is we can hold off because we're not going to do the other two right now. We don't have to put them on now. So maybe we will put them on in the next day or two when I do the other ones. And we'll decide if we want the door. Because we definitely don't want the door on that side. But. So then I guess we are done. Let me show you these cute little designs, though, that go on the door. So there's. Uh, this is for the outside. The, the main part of the door. And then you can also. Um color in the inside of those little windows in there. So that's for the long one. And this is for the small door and then different, uh, different little configurations for windows. So that's awesome. So we will decide on doors and windows when we have all three, all three of them done. So you have to come back two more times because we'll do another house for two nights, right? We'll do another house and then we'll decide on doors and windows. Okay, so let me let me show you how we clean our transfers. And just in case anybody's new, so Barbie I'm sure knows how to do this and my regulars know how to do this, but maybe somebody's watching the replay that hasn't seen this and you're thinking, what a mess that is to clean up. It really isn't. And we do need to clean these up pretty quickly. So this is what I do. I move that out of the way so it doesn't get sprayed. I just spray it with water. This happens to be distilled water, but it does not have, it can just be tap water. I like to start with either a paper towel or these are like reusable paper towels. They're called Swedish dishcloths. I got these. I got these on Amazon and I think I got these at the container store. But anyway, they're, they're just a, a really thick, uh, cloth that is like a paper towel but it's reusable and I like to start by taking that top layer of paste off with a paper towel because that kind of saves wear and tear on my board eraser which I will bring out next so I like the top layer to get it to get the bulk of it off with that but you can see it, it left a lot behind so it's not perfect that's why i bring out my poor dirty well-loved board eraser which will soon be replaced but it's still working okay so this is like a magic eraser except there's it's chemical free so we don't want to use chemicals on these transfers that will eat away at the transfer and it will eat away at the adhesive and so I'm just taking this and you can see it's pulling, it's pulling off paste that that uh, paper towel wasn't, wasn't getting. Now some of this is stained because our black is highly pigmented. So it is, it has actually stained the transfer, but as long as I don't have any paste in the screen, it doesn't matter if it's stained. That won't affect how it's how it's usability. The magic is in that silk screen. Okay, so I flipped it over. I'm cleaning paste off of this side. I'm also cleaning off any fuzz that we put on. Hey, Patty, thanks for joining us. Another one on on Eastern Eastern time. Okay, so this is believe it or not, this is clean. It's just stained. It's not going to come off. Again, highly pigmented, which is good because that means it covers really well. And this one, you can see, I don't know if you can see it. That green is a little too close to the teal, but it's this board eraser is pulling off the excess paste and I'm just rinsing it out, wringing it out, making sure that screen is clean.
Okay, so front and back. Back side, I am making sure I'm getting off any fuzz that's on there. Flip it over a time or two. And if at all possible, let your transfers air dry. Don't heat them with a heat gun. <laughs> you will melt them. And I even hesitate using my quick dry tool because I don't want to apply any heat to it that breaks down the adhesive. If at all possible, let them air dry. If you're in a hurry to get them put away, you can take a paper towel while they're still wet and dry that off. Um, don't take a paper towel to it once it's dry though, or you'll have fibers all stuck in it. But if, it, if at all possible, let it air dry. And then when you are, when, it, when it's dry, you put it back on its backer sheet and store it away in its little cellophane, uh, cellophane home. And it will be good 10 to 12 times minimum. I know people who have gotten, have gotten 25 uses out of a single transfer. So the, the kit, the, the wooden cutout kit comes with three different, the three different size houses and the little doors and windows. You could always add your own. You could always just chalk them straight on and not, not on a third dimensional. Or you could take the transfer and you could put this on a flat surface. It doesn't have to be on a on one of our wooden cutouts and it'd still look just as pretty. So if you're interested, again, if you're interested in the supplies, in purchasing the wood cutouts or the transfer or the paste, type in houses on, my, uh, on the comments and my bot will send you a link. Don't forget about my flash sale. In the pinned comments, there's a link to the VIP page um, where you can you can go to that post and find out the details of the flash sale. And flash sale is basically anything in stock in the catalog is at a discount depending on whether you're a VIP member or if you're a club member. There's also a special for shipping. There's a way you can get free shipping, um, but I can't mention that on my business page. So if you're not a member of my VIP group, it is absolutely free. And it's just my private page where I can offer deals and discounts where I can't do that on this page. So anyway, here is house number one. Leave your worries at the door. And then cute little design on the other side. It's going to make a darling little collection. Can't wait to get it all done. So. Get you some. Keep going. Do another. <laughs> no, I can't. I can't. I could, but I'm not. You have to have something, have something to do tomorrow. <laughs> okay, so let's see. And you know what? I'm sorry. I have to apologize. I keep playing with this hair. I'm at that stage. Do I cut it? Do I let them grow? They're driving me crazy. You know. You know, oh, don't. Trip. <laughs> what did you just say nothing i didn't say a word i said you're beautiful you did not you i, yeah, I, I said i said they're driving me crazy and you said that's a short trip <laughs> i would never, you would never say never, that about never. your bride <laughs> he's he's crazy too he's <laughs> he's driving the car that's what it is okay so Leave your worries at the door and do something creative and buy something because I have to sell $230 worth of stuff by tomorrow at midnight. Just kidding. Not kidding. Whatever. I don't know. You got to eat. What? She said she was outside feeding all the cats. That's what she <laughs> well, you can watch the replay over and over and over. Pretend it's a different house. I have to figure out what I'm going to do different on all the other ones, too. So anyway, I have to do some research. And I'm looking for somebody's baby milestones. I'll look up your name again on the... I'll see if I can find it. Okay, I think that's it for tonight. So uh, if you have any... Okay, if you have any any questions or comments, leave them, leave them in the comments, send me a message, whatever, reach out. If you want to chat, if you want to do this, 
I bought lots already. <laughs> if you um, if you want to join Club, which is a monthly subscription service, let me know. If you want to if you want to get forty percent off, which is a whole lot better than my flash sale. If you're interested in a way to get forty percent off, even fifty five percent off some of your products, um, reach out to me and we'll chat about it. I'll tell you I'll tell you tell you all about it. Okay, I think that's it. So I'm going to I'm going to pose with my little house so that I have a pretty thumbnail for this video. Always pretty when you're in it, sweet. Quit kissing up. My job is to kiss up. Okay, so I've got that. Okay, so we will see you, I believe, tomorrow night. Six o'clock is what the schedule shows. We've got some different things coming up, different times coming up this week. I'll let you know about it, but. Keep watching for us on Facebook. Keep commenting on our posts. That really helps us. It makes Facebook think we are popular, and they will share our page with other people. Anyway, yeah, take that, Zuckerberg. Yeah, yeah. Shh, don't, don't, don't jinx it. Anyway, thanks for staying with us, and have a great week. And we will see you tomorrow. Bye bye.